Hey guys, and as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be making a mini gingerbread house. I already opened it. Here's the mini gingerbread house. So, um, what you're going to be needing is these two ginger... So, it came with these two gingerbread things to build the house with. And then it came with this icing. And then it came with these candy lights. And another candy, which I don't really know what these are. But it's all edible. And then just because there's only two things, I got some candy for my Halloween basket. Yes, I still have my candy. Um, for my Halloween, from Halloween. So I'm going to be using some of these. Maybe not the sour ones, not the sour stones. And then I'm going to be decorating it on this little Christmas plate. So, let's see what the directions say. Okay, so we have to need this for a minute. I'm gonna cut this out. Okay, so um, the things that we are supposed to build the house with were together, so my mom cut the pieces. Like that. And then, as I was saying, I have these candies, and then I already kneaded the icing for a minute. Um, so now it says... So, um, what we were on was, um, it says to, um, remove the things. So, we're going to put them on this little cardboard that it came with. Okay, so I just now emptied these. I'm going to try one of these. Those are pretty good. They kind of taste like, like, um, I don't know what they taste like, but they're good. I'm gonna, and then I'm going to try a purple one of these little things. They are good too, but I like the little bells or lights. <laughs> anyway, so we're going to move those. And I'm going to start building the gingerbread house. And then I have these scissors. Cut the icing bag. So we're gonna need these two square pieces. And add this. Okay, so we're gonna I'm gonna build it on this little thing, so what it says is to put two sides of icing and then put one like that and then the other side. This is going to be a really tiny gingerbread house guys. I didn't know. I, I thought it was going to be a little big. Bigger. But nope. Okay, I want to try the icing. It looks like goop. Okay, so after this dries, we're going to put the roof on. So see you guys in probably like 30 minutes, even though it's going to be like five seconds for, or less for you guys. So, yeah. Okay, so the roof is dry now, but before we, uh, I mean, before we put on the two roof pieces, let's just clean up for um, a little bit like this area. Okay, so... Again, all we need is the icing still. So we have to be really gentle because I don't know if it is all the way dry. So off camera, I put some icing on. It doesn't technically like fit on there, right? But it's fine. At least it's going to taste good, hopefully. <laughs> Here, I'm actually going to try some of the gingerbread cookies. Okay. Instant replay of what just happened. Try this again. Without breaking. Okay, until I get it settled, this is going to be cut out. 
Okay, so I just put on one side of the roof. Hopefully it doesn't fall. Instead of moving the gingerbread house, I'm gonna carefully spin this. Okay, so there's like this big gap on the top. So I'm gonna try to fix that up with some icing. Okay, so the icing part isn't doing good, so I feel like we're gonna have to like decorate right now. So for the top, like it did on the box, I think. I think theirs had a big gap on it too. So um, what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to put these little things, which I was trying to make it not look similar, but I feel like I'm gonna have to for most of the part. But mainly for these, like, cause there is a huge gap. Like, um, well, it's not huge, but it's big enough to where I don't really like it. So, and thank goodness, like, these are just the perfect size. So time lapse of me decorating. Okay, so I did those. So I'm gonna pause the video or else um, this video is gonna be super long. So I'm gonna decorate without the video rolling or else this will be like a 23 minute long video. So um, you guys will see me when this tiny gingerbread house is done. Okay, so as you guys can tell, you can only see the little droplets because it broke. So, um, this is what I have for you. Okay, and, yeah. So I did use some Skittles and I didn't use anything else. But I am going to be trying it. Okay, let's get this piece. Whoa. Gotta get a Skittle on that. Can't bite it. There we go. It's good. I just wish it would have looked better. Like I tried to fix it like five times. And this is what you got. And I still have like a whole bunch of icing left. Well, it's not a lot, but an icing bite. The icing is probably one of my favorites. So we're gonna try it again and try to get like most of the candies in my mouth. I'll go a thumbs up. Well, maybe like sideways. So, this is what the gingerbread house was supposed to look like. And then, this is mine. Don't they look the same? Yep, they totally do. So, so thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share for this gingerbread house. Definitely subscribe. So, this gingerbread house, for this gingerbread house, just do it. And thank you guys for watching. Bye. <laughs> Bye.